is a stunning new report by the Associated Press painting a bleak economic picture here in the U.S. Take a look at these numbers. It finds four out of five American adults struggle with joblessness, near poverty, or reliance on welfare at some point in their lives. One reason cited, the loss of good-paying manufacturing jobs here at home. And the number of poor people remain stuck at a, a record level, 46 million, or 15 percent of the population. Stuart Varney, Varney and Company hosts Fox Business Network with me now. Stuart, good morning to you. Michael. Is this as bad as people think, the study suggests? Yes, it is. And in fact, it's getting worse. Middle class people are seeing their incomes, their real incomes, decline. What they can buy with their incomes is in decline. And the pace is actually speeding up. For lower income workers, it's 4% decline over the Obama years. For some categories of, of labor, it's even worse than that. But over the four years of President Obama's first term, that speed of declining real incomes has actually speeded you look up. At, you look at the stock market, I mean, it's booming. Uh, I mean, we're at record highs. What yep. explains that? But that is because Ben Bernanke is pumping a trillion dollars a year into the economy, 85 billion a month. He is the stimulus which is helping the stock market and helping the housing market. So far, it has not helped the economy. So you take away the ink and perhaps the bulls are not running as much as they have been. That's true. Uh, yeah, others will contend the policy's wrong. You can't keep taxing more and adding regulations and then as a result expect growth. Yeah, what if would I may, you say to that? I would say that, in my opinion, that is accurate. This week, we're going to get numbers which show the economy is only growing at about a 1% pace. That's nowhere near good enough. 1%? Yes, 1%, maybe 1.5%. If we had growth of 4, 5, 6%, that would lift all boats and a lot of this, some of this insecurity and joblessness would certainly disappear. But in the immediate future, it's not going to happen. What are you going to get from 1%? I mean, that's, that's Belgium, baby. Uh, yeah, <laughs> close. <laughs> that's true. We're like Europe. Yeah. Very much like Europe. See you at 920. Yes, sir. FBN, Barney and Company. Check them out. Thank you, Stuart. Nice to see you on a Monday. What's coming?